Hey everybody, my name is Sultan Humaid Al Zaabi, and I got the two tasks of 2.7 and 2.8. So, two, the PC 2.7 was asking me to define numerical data as the data that has a sense of measurement involved in it, and it is often uh, referred to as a quantitative data in statistics, and give example on it. So, when they said define numerical data, numerical data is a type is a da is a data type expressed in number rather than neutral language description sometimes called quantitative data numerical data is always collected in number four numerical data differentiates itself with other number from data types with its ability to carry out ar arithmetic operations with these numbers for example so this is the example Numerical data of the number of male students and female students in a class may be taken, then added together to get the total number of students in the class. The, char the characteristic is one of the major ways of identifying numerical data. My second PC, PC 2.8. They said differentiate between the two types of numerical data, including discrete and con continuous data types, and give example on each. Discrete data is information that can only take certain values, so this is the differentiation. These types of data is often represented using tally charts, bar charts, or pie charts. Continuous data is data that can take any value, height, weight, temperature, and length are all example of continuous data. So here is the completion of 2.8. They said, there are two types of numerical data, namely discrete data, which represent countable items, and continuous data, which represent a and data measurement. The continuous type of numerical data are further subdivided into interval and ratio data, which is known to be used for measuring items. Discrete data definition. Discrete data is a type of numerical data which represent countable items. They take on values that can uh, gr uh, be grouped in, into a list where the list may either be fin finite or infinite. Whether finite or infinite, discrete data take on counting numbers like 1 to 10 or 1 to infinity, which is you cannot count until the end, with these groups of numbers being countably finite and countably infinite respectively. An example of discrete data will be counting the cups of water required to empty a bucket and counting the cups of water required to empty an ocean. The former is finite countable where the latter is infinite countable. Continuous data. This is a type of numerical data which represents measurements. The values are described, they said measurements. So the values are described as intervals on a real number line. Rather than take counting number, for example, the cumulative grade point average in a point in a five point grading system defined first class students as those whose G C G P A falls under four point fifty two fifty. A student may score a point. 4.44, 4.495. I just went to the second line because it was along there and there. Uh, it is going to be the same. Uh, you know, for um, a student may score a point four point four nine five two point one two five three point five or any possible number from zero to five. In this case, the continuous data is regarded as being uncountably finite. Here are the references that I got my information from. Thank you.